Good afternoon, Fenlanders. How are you? We are not at our farm again. It seems like we don't do any work, but we do, <laughs> I promise, I promise. We are out in Huntington, just having a look at this lovely new Q285 Beltra. Been invited by TNS to come over here and, um, and have a look and have a little play. We're gonna go and have a play and see what we think to the new Q Series Beltra. I mean, my cousin Martin's got a Beltra and I've used it a few times, so I know my way around a little bit, but um, there's gonna be a few people here that are gonna teach me how to drive it properly. So we're gonna go out in the tractor, have some fun, uh, go cruising around, see how we get on. Cheers, guys. <laughs> I can have a nap. <laughs> it's pretty spacey in there, isn't it? Pretty uh, cool. Look at the. Um... I mean, oh my goodness, my little legs cannot do this. Wait for me, I got a little leg. <laughs> Not even joking. Ooh. I've noticed some slight issues straight away. What's that? You look at my armrest. What? It hits the side. Um, this must lift up, surely. Um, where am I? Did you break it already? I broke Literally, it already. we've been in it for two seconds. I think that's as far as the seat spins around. Oh, it's some heavy old growing. Look. Watch one coming past as we speak. Just gone through that sprayer wheel and pulled him right up. We just stay in here all day. This is really quite comfortable actually. It's not cold. <laughs> it's not windy and it's not cold in here. Yeah. So. Look how windy it is. It's baby rolling. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I like looking behind me and I can't quite. It's a long way around to look. That's good. The sunroof goes out the right way. It lets some fresh air in. What more? How more simple can you get? You like that? Yeah, I like that. Do you know what else it lets in? What? Bumblebees. Uh, yeah, it can let in bumblebees, yeah. <laughs> and and have wasps. A little, have a little tear up in the cab while you're trying to lie. And hornets. Like yeah. And spiders. Um, but um, on other manufacturers, it, the sunroof opens the other way. So oh, yeah, yeah. all that does is let the dust in from the back. Yeah. <laughs> hang on, hang on. There you go. Can you see? <laughs> You're filming, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Yeah, so yeah, I, got I, am. My, I got my Fenland Farming Adventures hat on and my hoodie. <laughs> and a voucher. Hat. Remember to get by in fact. Nearly Christmas. <laughs> We're in a new Q Series voucher now, so I bet you all you got with my big nose in there, isn't <laughs> With Gareth, Jones yeah. from Valtra. Yeah. This is the 285. Yeah, the black ones are 305 over there. With the, 305. That's 305. Pulling yeah. six metre cultivation there. I was going to say it's making it work hard, isn't it? Yeah, and then we just got a six metre drill on the back of this. Yeah. So ignition on. Yeah. Foot on the clutch. Clutch to start, but then you won't need it after that. Cool. New forward reverse lever Valtra. Yeah. Okay, on new fifth generation. So forwards and reverse. Yeah. Neutralise as well. Push away is neutral. Yeah. Click back into handbrake. Yeah. Okay. So that there. Yeah. And then uh, the screen just booting up. You stick all the lights on. Okay. Okay. Just click on the auto power. That's press the auto. That's it. Yeah. And then tick the green tick. Okay. okay so we now got the guidance working. Got okay, lights. And we'll stick the lights. So. Yeah, it's illuminated around the lights now. That's cool. Is it perfect. Oh, I'm All gonna right. have to put the beacons on as well. Okay, happy? Yeah, we're all good, yeah. Right, okay, so basically all we've got is uh, an A and B range for the CVT transmission. Yeah. This um, is all new. All new as well, yeah. I've got no dashboard now. Yep. So the dashboard's all gone from here. Yeah, it makes sense. So everything now on is the pillar. on your pillar display here. Yeah. And uh, very yeah, futuristic. Very clear, and that's all altered by the, the uh, turn, oh, turn buckle on the steering wheel. Oh, that's handy. Right, so that is in all the tractors now, so even in the active gets that screen. Yeah. Right, so this is the um, Q285. So we've got the full armrest with the smart touch screen and the second screen as well for Isobus. Yep. Uh, for the drill behind. Uh, and then we've got basically drive lever, so you can move the drive lever and just push it forward and we start to move. Yep. Okay, so you can use your drive pedal, your drive lever, yep. and cruise control all simultaneously, and it, uh, you can do that. And there, there your cruise is. So now I'll find our guidance line, so we're in auto steering now. Yep. So just move your lever forward, so that take over of your pedal, and then push the green one for throw it forward, and off we go. You knock it sideways, the gear stick sideways. Away from me? Yep. Okay, so now you're in cruise speed, yep. and you can increase, increase your cruise speed on the roller with your thumb. That's it. Yeah. So we could do sort of 12k, it'd be just nice. Yeah. So you got your RTK on there, all your spool valves. Yep. 
um, and all your work processes as well. You've got automatic turn. Uh, you can have automatic turn, that's smart turn basically. Yeah. So you've got auto yeah. auto headland management. Yeah. So which does it with your, your boundary line. Yeah. Uh, and then, so if you want to try the lever itself and you see the, the control of the lever, you just gently pull it back and you'll see the speed. So your drive lever, just gently pull it back. So it's a totally proportional lever. Yeah, yeah, I'm with you. Yeah, because I yanked on it to start with, didn't I? So it's, it's not an increment pull, yeah. it's a totally proportional lever. Yeah. Customers causing chaos. <laughs> any of these features you can you can adjust. Yeah. So if you wanted to put an engine cruise, you can put forward speed cruise, you can put lifting the machine up. So if you want to uh, lift the hydraulics up, so first of all you press the hydraulics. Yeah. Okay, so we yeah. I think we're on three. Uh, yes, I think we're on three, yeah. Okay, so and then click on that for five seconds which can be altered by turning either the dial or like you've just done there. Yeah, Doesn't yeah, matter. okay, yeah. All right, okay. Okay, so, but then you can just e keep adding whatever you want to in there. So yeah, let, let me... Know, uh, engine speed, engine cruise, that's it. So cruise speed, yeah. So set that to about 10, 12K, if you want to. Yeah, yeah. perfect. Engage so then, sat nav. Yeah, guidance. That one? Yep. Oh, I could have yeah. been a voucher driver. Okay, so basically the beauty is as well with our system, you just go, just take one of the... Just uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Right, just for our, the beauty is with the, with the Vulture, you can actually think, right, well, I, I want that to happen there, so you just click the box and you can actually pick it up and move it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. wherever you want to yeah. in the sequence. So if it's not working, as you get to the yeah. end, it's not and working. The other thing probably. you can do, which not all manufacturers can do this either, we can do it either on time or, or, or distance, you see. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. If you want to do it for so many seconds or so many meters. Yeah, okay. All right, so, so what's that? that? Yeah. Okay. Seconds. So yeah. that'd be, yeah. Five seconds. After the last sequence, the next sequence. Oh, next okay, sequence. yeah, delay, a delay. You've got it. Yeah, okay. All right. Cool, yeah. So you can pretty much, you can adjust if you're in a square you field, you're all good. That's right, work of course, because at the moment, so we'll take the box here, for yeah. example. So if I just go, okay, here, see it, we're on Amazon. Yeah. That's your profile, so that, that we've just set now is set to that profile for this Amazon drill. Okay. So as soon as you plug it in, you go to Amazon, click the box at the top. Yeah. And go, all right. I don't want it. Ultra. I don't want Amazon. Or if you jump and another driver jumps on it, you can copy that one and then alter it slightly. Yeah. And then can be Amazon yeah. name to the customer. Or yeah. The, you know, yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, those people are different, aren't they? You've people turn around different, yep. don't they? So exactly. Take longer. Yep. You can make it however you want. To. Yeah. Yeah. It's um, becoming very, very personal now, isn't it? Yes. The user interface is becoming your own tractor, You've but somebody it. else can get on it and it'd be yeah. set up to you. But the beauty is you can set your own profiles for each machine, so it's almost professional that one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> in, in two rounds, I'm a professional voucher driver now. But of course, the beauty is if something wasn't quite right that came down a couple of seconds too early, then you could have just edited it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you as you're working in. across a field with scoops and stuff, yep. you can change that completely, can't you? You've got it. Just as you, I mean, it gives you something to do while you're going up and down all day. Yep. Know how to work it completely. Yep. You want to have a go? Yeah. I'm, yep. I'm not going to drive it. I'll drive you, just sit on the passenger seat. That, that yeah. sounds a better idea. This could possibly go disastrously wrong. <laughs> hey, you're driving. Yeah, just go and have a go. Anna's going to drive it. So this should be interesting. You'll be right. This is my sister who is completely at home driving her Chelsea tractor around. Now she's finally got her hands on a tractor. She may get scared. Gar Gareth was mega. Gareth couldn't fault him, so thank you to Gareth for showing us around it. He is a smart looking tractor, isn't it? With a 1200 kilo weight block. I do like the weight block. 600 kilos at the top and 600 kilos at the bottom. You can drop off, so that's a clever idea. 285 horsepower. And a drill like my friend Sam Duchesne has got and Richard Duchesne and Ruth, so. Thank you to them for my cups of tea yesterday. I went and said hello to them um, while I was out picking my cultivator up at a farm sale. Oh, so what have I got here? So basically, <laughs> Make it so you can actually reach your paddles, might help. Because <laughs> I'm really sure. Just bear in mind that I'm used to a high Hyundai, <laughs> not a tractor. Easier to drive than I am. Oh, is it? Okay, cool. All right. 
Okay, so that's your drive lever. Okay. Drive pedal, drive lever. Okay. So basically, you've got forward and reverse on here. So on the games forward, you just drive. Is that it? That's it. It's all easy. Oh. <laughs> drive down there. And Anna is off. Anna is off in a new Q Series Voucher. I don't know who should be more worried. <laughs> <laughs> you totally fibs. You said you were going to drive. I lied a little. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> Daniel will be wearing his pants watching me drive a tractor. Right, now press M1. M1? Let's go to the steering wheel. Oh, can I go? Check that. I told you we weren't driving. Oh, no. See, I wasn't lying. <laughs> this is easier than my Hyundai. <laughs> what does that do? Just drive, drive, it takes over your pedal. Oh, so I can so take my foot off? Yep. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is kind of good thing. I need like some L-plates on this thing. Turn it off? Yeah, Okay. Go on, right, man. <laughs> okay, now let's go to the steering and press M1. Let go. Let go of the steering, press M1. There we go. Oh, that's great. Thing. We've got a good lineup of tractors here anyway. Loads of other little tractors and stuff. Anna's probably already been around and filmed them, but the thing I like about vouchers is you can have them in any colour you want. A nice little shiny red one. Look at this, look. Metallic blue. This is the same as what my cousin Martin has got. That's a nice looking little tractor and it all looks fairly simple, straightforward. Got handles for spool valves, which is simple, straightforward. Let's get in it and have a look, shall we? Oh, Sid locked it up. T255. This is a Q. All right, Will? Thanks for inviting us. Always a pleasure. Anna's driving the other tractor. I see that, yeah. Uh, I'm so. here with Andy, is that right? Yeah, Andy yeah, Miller. Yeah. From Voucher. Uh, he's just going to talk us through the new queue. Yeah, well, basically we're here. We've uh, we've called it the Q uh, Road Show. It's the first time that the tractor's been uh, available in the UK for anybody to have a look at. And it's we launched it at the beginning of September. Did a virtual launch with it. Of course, nowadays we're allowed to come and see each other, yep. so that's great. So <laughs> we've got it in here, and this has probably been awaited for probably three or four years now. And it fills in the, what we call the gap in theory on the horsepower between about 230 up to 300 for a, a little bit heavier sort of chassis um, machine with a, a variable transmission on it, a uh, big 7.4 litre echo uh, power engine in it, giving all the features that you want for a big heavy cultivation tractor with technologies on it and the bits and bobs. Like all the other vouchers, you can have lots of options on it, unlimited different colours, bits and bobs on there. We're sitting in here, for example, at the moment, if you, if you like S-Line as I do, because I drive an Audi, <laughs> nice little sort of dark, you know, surrounds and chrome and leather steering wheel. It is comfy in here. Yeah, it's nice, yeah. isn't it? So it, what we're looking at is a machine that will fit into the, the sort of for everything right the way down. It's flexible enough to do general haulage work, sort of uh, uh, corn cart, that sort of stuff during the, the, the harvest, right the way through to almost a primary cultivation machine. Okay. So yeah, quite versatile as we normally try and try and make it with Ultra. And um, yeah, we look forward to it. The machines will be rolling, they're rolling off the production line already. And the first ones will be in the UK. We estimate somewhere in end of November, beginning of December, that you can actually physically come and see it at your, your dealers or somewhere else in the country. And then they'll be available for delivery in the spring of 2023. So cool. Just to go through the sort of Q series range on here, we start with a 225 right the way through in 20 horsepower increments up to a 305, so 220, 240, 260, and so on, right the way up. Looked really, I suppose, to make a pretty versatile tractor, but at this, this bigger horsepower. And uh, as I say, it's fitting in with the sort of ethos of us having a very nimble, maneuverable tractor. It's quite a, 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 a large tractor as far as horsepower in the sectors it, that it's in, but if you jump in it, have a go with it, you know, the wheelbase is only sort of 50 millimeters longer than our, our smaller T-series range. Turning circle, very good, 5.25 meters on the T, a little bit more on, on this one, but uh, great chassis design so it can get around the field there. A lot of the technologies in it as well, nowadays yeah. with your modern arable farming and particularly there. So they come as uh, almost standard with a, with a tractor, so comfort and, and technology packages. In the cab here, you can see we've got, uh, on this particular one, we've got the normal displays and screens that you would see on the tractor. Uh, a pillar, normal display, and we've got extra um, screens for guidance, isobus, those sort of technologies. Uh, and of course, this is a CVT, so it's all multi-controller, 
uh, Valtra, Valtra Arm as we call it here. And, and of course, because I like to talk to you a little bit about the premium interior, but little things like, you know, nice phone holders in here, plenty of charging and, and power points. And nice and comfortable because I'm an old guy now, so I like a seat that's comfortable. <laughs> so we can have that, that we can feel very comfy in as well. But keeping all the other sort of uh, features, shall we say, of the sound of Ultra Rain. So yeah. uh, robust, reliable, a lot of power. To, but don't believe me. Wait until they come in the country. And you'll be able, <laughs> then you'll be able to see them on your farm, doing whatever. And you can see uh, for yourself what, the, what they'll physically do. Fab, thank you so much. You're thank welcome. you. <laughs> Rainy day can only mean sunglasses. An another trip to McDonald's. I want summer to be back. <laughs> I got myself some uh, nice handy dandy uh, Valtra sunglasses and I uh, decided to keep them on in full Stevie Wonder style. <laughs> even though it's raining and it's dark outside. You look, uh, you look proper gangster right now. Uh, yeah, can't thank Voucher enough for having us. I don't really get involved with Voucher too much. I know my cousin's got a N174 that I've driven a couple of times and I quite liked it. I mean, I've had one on demo ages ago and it was all right. So yeah, it was good to go and check out the new Q series. We're back on the farm now so I can hug some green paint. <laughs> I know I can have my Voucher in green. Yeah, it's good. I, li I like the Voucher. It's a nice place to be. I had it all figured out. As you've just seen, fairly easily. Even Anna managed to drive it, didn't he? I know. So, Fleming tricked me, didn't he? Yeah, <laughs> he'll switch your room. He was like, he was like, you get in, you get in, and, and I'll drive. I was like, yeah, you drive, and he was like, oh, okay, yeah. Oh, look, you're in the driver's seat. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, oh my god, I'm driving it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So if it's simple enough for you to get in and drive, I mean, anyone could drive it. Yeah, it's uh, simple enough for everybody else. I managed to get the um, automation from like dropping the cultivator in, or the drill in, we had a drill on the back, dropping the drill in, setting the cruise speed, and then setting the sat nav and everything like that. I managed to set that, so when I got to the other end, that it had done it all for me. And then when I dropped back in again, it done it all for me again. So things like that go a long way. If you can set things to do things for you like that, it takes the load off you. Cool. The only thing I didn't like is the, um, well, I like my seat to swivel. Oh yeah, you didn't when like you that bit, did you? the armrest hit the, hit the mud guard on the inside. Nothing too major. But um, other than that, it's a nice place to be. The seat is comfortable, really comfortable. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you hit the like button. Check out the other ones on screen, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Keep on toshing. <laughs>